relationship is something that requires constant work. Doc, I just feel like sometimes he's not even trying anymore. Seriously, he's okay. clingy, he's terrified of being by himself. Given all these strong feelings, why don't you hold hands? Um, he's literally reaching out for you. He won't hold my hand. Oh, you you got to interlock it, though. If you don't interlock you it, you might as well just be friends. I'm and not partners. Two years ago, the hilarious comedy 21 Jump Street was released. It did exceptionally well at the box office and received great reviews from both critics and fans. Of course, a sequel was inevitable. So now, Jonah Hill and Channing Tatum, aka Schmidt and Jenko, are back for 22 Jump Street. 22 Jump Street uh, picks up with Schmidt and Jenko going undercover at college, but it's not the college they thought, it's an online college and they end up screwing up really badly and then going undercover at a real college and what they grow to find is that sometimes your relationship gets strained when you go to college and like you would go into college and you're gonna have growing pains and see if you know the relationship as like a girl or a guy or your high school sweetheart whether they be guys and guys or girls and girls and girls and guys see if they can make it through college uh, and still be together how you bitches like jump street now hey i got a big ass raise to babysit you too Again. You going back to high school? No, you dumb. <laughs> Your ass look like you about fifty. You going to MC State? Play on play. Why every time you speak, I want to throw the f up? In Twenty One Jump Street, the two extremely unqualified cops took down a bunch of high school drug dealers. After this huge success, you would expect that they became the top police team. However, things don't always work out as planned. Jenko wants a little bit more, you know, he's ready to graduate, he thinks one bus is enough to like, you know, do something even cooler now, or, you know, whatever that means. And, uh, you know, Schmidt is sort of, he's happy with, you know, he's just happy with us just staying together and doing what we need to do to get by. We need an expert to consult. I heard someone's bringing a ton of that stuff down to Puerto Mexico for spring break. That's your lead! I know, but we don't know who it is. Uh, we don't know who it is. But you gotta take your thing to the next level, guys. Spring break. A grenade. You never know. Oh, why are you gonna put it there? Feels right. In the first movie, the foul street smart Captain Dixon had a pretty small part. The fans loved him so much, though, that actor Ice Cube was given a much bigger role for the sequel.